Hey y'all and welcome back to the DG Outdoors channel guys. In today's video guys we're going to be replacing the grips on the Heritage Rough Rider. So these are Coca Bola grips I think they call them. They're wood grips and I wanted an American flag grips to put on them. And I wanted to keep the wood look. Now these are not wood grips but these are American flag grips with a wood like laminate to them okay. I got these for $20 on eBay, and here's why. Right here, there's a very, 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 very small rubbing spot that the person said happened in the box whenever they shipped it. No big deal for me. A lot cheaper. So, this should be super easy to replace. I'm going to put you guys up here on the gun mat, and we are going to replace the grips on the Heritage Rough Rider. Still waiting on my 22 WMR or 22 mag cylinder to get here, so when that gets here from... Um, Heritage, we will do a review on it, show you guys how to switch out the cylinders real easy, and then eventually I'll do a shooting video for you guys. So let's get over to the shooting mat and I'll show you guys how to put this on. Hi right, guys, I'm sorry for the angle, this is the best one that you can do. So we're going to start by taking the uh, old grips off here. You guys are going to want a micro screwdriver like this. I have a set that I bought at the Dollar Tree of little micro screwdrivers here. What I'm using is an 330 seconds, let's see, uh, flathead, 330 seconds flathead. Pretty much there's a screw right here, okay, and you're going to want to take it out. And I've watched YouTube videos on how to do this. That's how I learned how to do everything is just to watch YouTube. So it should come out. Now, there's a little pin right here that you want to keep in here. Here's what the inside of the grip looks like, okay? We're going to use the screw that came with these. There's a little pin on the inside here that you want to stay in right here, this little pin. Okay, there's the spring guide. But there's a pin right here. And if you guys look, what's right here? A little indention for the new grips, okay? And you want that to sit right in there. So we are going to slide this on here. Put, make sure that pin sits right here in that spot. Line it up, okay? Make sure I get this back in camera. Okay, here's the screw that came in it. And we're just going to line that up like that. Pretty good. And then screw her down. Don't want to over tighten it too tight. But I don't want to come over it off either. How's that look on there? I think... It looks pretty good, guys. Let's uh, switch over the camera here and uh, talk about this grip. All right, y'all. So I got the American flag grips from eBay on here. These grips are called Premier Gold Rough Rider grips. I think they're aftermarket grips. Um, you guys look. They've got a little bit of wiggle play in them. They don't exactly fit very snug. You guys see that? And I've tried messing with the little pin in here off camera. I've tried tightening it down the best that I can. And I don't know if I really like these very well or not, to be honest with you. Um, I may just go on Rough Riders website and actually order them from Heritage. Will they work? Yeah, I mean... You're going to have a little play in your handles, and I don't like that at all. Um, but that's how you replace the grips. That was the whole point of this video. I'll try them out. If they work okay, they work okay. It's just, literally, guys, look. A little bit of play in that handle, and I don't like that at all. Tighten them down the best I could. Put the little pin in here. So, I do have some American flag grips for it, though. So, you all remember, like, comment, subscribe. Jesus loves you. And I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.